Roca, how you doing? Here we are on the Sea to Sky Highway on our way to Britannia Beach. And uh, Mark, what uh, what are we going to find there today? Today we've, uh, we're going to look at an outflow pipe from Britannia, the old Britannia Beach mine. That I think just fresh water is flowing through now. It's uh, they, they put a filtration system to keep all the bad stuff out of the ocean that it used to dump in there and that you know 25 years ago that whole area was dead there was no sea life at all and the uh, mine had pumped in bad acid water which is a byproduct of their processing for copper and gold and things and since they've treated it this video is six years ago the newest one we can find is six years old and there was a lot of sea anemones, uh, octopus, all around and on this pipe. So we're going to go see what it looks like now. Bit of a trail here. What do you think there, Roka? We're, gonna... we're looking for a carving by a local artist. He carved one of these huge oh, trees. And then apparently the pipe is right by the carving. I think by those pilings over there, that's where the sunken, there's some sunken ships here. We found something, Roka. Oh, jeez. Somebody lost their floaty. Could use that on the, the mini Calypso. Oh. So we'll make our way down this beach and see if we can find the, the pipe. old building with a bit of graffiti on it. Oh, somebody trusted this board to walk across it, but woo, I don't think I would. Mac, could you walk across this platform to make sure that it's, it can handle our weight? Just a demonstration of how sturdy it is. Here's Mac before. After calling search and rescue, because he's crumpled way down there. You could have a cool little concert in here yeah. with that view. Okay, well, we know it's not here. And we've been looking for it's the dive site, and it's marked by a, a carving, which we had trouble finding, and Mark found it. So, Mark. I think this is the carving back. Looked at the picture and you can see the same eyes. It was from a local artist. And he had carved this, but it was facing the other way in the information we had. And now the tide must have come up and spun this huge thing at one point. But it's been about six years from the data that we're working on. So. But that's definitely the carving. And there's all these cement blocks. So it kind of stands to reason this is where maybe the outflow pipe is. We might have to just put the ROV in the water and go along parallel to the shoreline and see if we can just attach the pipe because we can't visually see it. It probably is buried. The outflow is buried. Sitting here having a little little bite to eat before we launch the uh, ROV, and I just kind of started looking, saying, "Hey, Mac, the uh, the entry points are going to be a little precarious. Somebody's going to get wet around the foot area, which you know probably would be Mac." And then I looked right there because we were going to fly along horizontally the beach to find the pipe, and I think that's the pipe right there. So the tide must be going down, Mac. And that's our target right there. That is awesome. That's exciting, Roka. I don't know what you guys are talking about. I don't see anything. Cool. So that might be easier to put it in the water too, in between waves. All right, so we're finally ready for a dive. Just getting close to one. Let's see the setup here. 
Mr. Olson, Roka Adventure Dog. Good day here at Britannia Beach uh, area. We're now just in the parking lot of the Britannia Beach mine. Uh, it was uh, a lot of sea life down on an outflow pipe that used to come from here, and then they cleaned it up over the last 20 years. I think they put some filter systems, and there used to be nothing in the harbor. Like when I used to scuba dive here, there was not a lot of sea life, and now there's a ton of sea life, so it's really cool. Mac and I are very impressed at how resilient the uh, sea life is and it's kind of all come back. So yeah, I'm very happy with that. So hope you enjoyed the, uh, the video and we're going to come back here and do some more searching because we know there's some octopus in here that we want to find. All right, rove out. Talk to you later.